Hello, my name is Tom Dwyer. I am the Editorial Director for BPM Institute and the instructor for this course. I'd like to spend the next 10 minutes describing the BPM Institute course titled Establishing Business Process Governance and Centers of Excellence. Establishing Process Governance and Centers of Excellence is the fourth course in the BPM Institute curriculum. Business Process Management is an enterprise-wide, structured approach to providing the products and services that your customers value most. It is grounded in the premise that you must take a process view of your company in order to understand what products and services your customers value most. This process view represents a new way of thinking. Introducing BPM into a company on an enterprise scale will be met with many challenges. Most often, a company will decide to first establish a core competency in BPM by establishing a center of excellence as a shared service. Years later, it will establish process governance as the way to completely institutionalize BPM as a discipline across the entire company. Understanding how to establish both a center of excellence and process governance is critical to a company's goal of practicing BPM on an enterprise scale. It is imperative if a company really wants to realize the benefits of BPM as a strategic approach to improving organizational performance. It is the difference between a program that delivers continuous value year over year and an investment that ebbs and flows, starts and stops. It is mandatory if your company really wants to institutionalize BPM. The course is intended for anyone who is part of or wants to be part of the adoption of BPM throughout the company. Whether you are part of the managerial decision-making process or want to understand how that decision-making process should evolve, you can benefit from the information provided in this course. It is intended for business analysts, business process analysts, process improvement team members, directors of a COE, CIOs, and policy-making executives. Students will learn what process governance is and how to establish it. They will learn how to design a charter for a center of excellence. They will learn how both can fit together within their current company organization. Perhaps you see the value of BPM and wonder if your company will ever embrace it strategically. Perhaps you've been assigned the job of creating a COE and want to know how to do this. Perhaps you've been involved in this effort for a while and want to compare your approach to industry best practices. Perhaps you want to be able to articulate the appropriate members in your company how they should be approaching strategic investments in BPM. Whichever of these circumstances match with yours, this course will provide the information you need to capitalize on the BPM value proposition for your company. Many attendees are not specifically assigned the responsibility for developing a COE, nor are they responsible for setting policy. However, they are engaged in BPM initiatives and want to understand how a company can best capitalize on them. Other attendees are just beginning to establish a COE, so they want to know how it has been done. All attendees, regardless of their specific job responsibility, appreciate the detailed information and use of real-world examples from their peers at other companies. It is our standard practice to solicit feedback from our students and to use that feedback to make improvements to our courses. Thank you for listening to this brief overview of establishing process governance and centers of excellence. It is part of an extensive program of over 24 course days of instruction. This course is held as part of bpminstitute.org's Certificate of Training Program. Please visit the website for more details about establishing process governance and centers of excellence and to register for it. Have a great day, and I look forward to meeting you in the class.